Ford Galaxy second generation, same platform as Ford S Max. Today we are going to replace pollen filter on this car. I'm going to show you how to do it. This is right hand drive. There are some videos about left hand drive and you have to remove accelerator pedal. We're going to show you how to do it on the right hand drive. Pollen filter on right hand drive vehicles is still on the left, but we don't have to remove accelerator pedal like on the left hand drives. All we have to do is just remove this cover. There are two clips. You squeeze them and pull them down like this and then you can remove this cover and then there is a fuse box so what we want to do is get under this fuse box we turn this plastic bit and then move it from this catch and there's also have a look on this side there are like uh, hinges for the fuse box so what we do we pull it down and then lift it up and take it off those hooks and your pollen filter is located behind this plastic door so remove these bolts and open this plastic door Take seven millimeter socket and go in there. And remove those screws. And this is how you access these little bolts. I think that's the best way. Simply then take this cover off and you can pull the pollen filter out. And this is the best position how you do it. You pull it out, you can squeeze it a little bit to help, and then you have to remember which way it was. The airflow comes from. Did they put it wrong? I think that what that's what they've done. They put it wrong way around. Whoever's done this air filter before shame on you because there is always arrow of showing where the airflow goes as you can see lots of dust on on this side and it's clean on this side they've done it wrong way around it must be this way so the airflow goes from the front to the bottom of this car we we'll take the new filter cheap one <laughs> because I think, uh, some filters can be it's not it's black not only because of the dust but it's also has a carbon see how much dust and the airflow pointing that way so what we're gonna put we're gonna put it this way and airflow goes this way this is the simple paper filter which also does this job this is one with this one with the carbon supposed to catch some particles some uh, poisonous particles whatever but this will do the job as well so we just simply slide it in So this cover is held normally by four screws. We have one missing, whoever done this 
job before they didn't do their job properly so they put the filter wrong way around and they lost the screw so what we're gonna do we can we're gonna put this back in there this is the best position how you can do it So this edge, you slide it first, and then you close it. Okay. And put the screws in. Put this fuse panel back into the hinges. One and two. And then we we'll simply catch it top with this metal, a little bent metal bit. Right here. See? Catch it with this. And then you just secure it with this clip. Then we we'll put the cover back in. And this clip just clip on easy peasy and this is how you replace pollen filter or cabin filter in a right hand drive vehicle more stuff about this car some other cars see my website wilsonmotors.com thank you for watching